Hey guys, this is Ia. You're listening to Arm Radio Global. Check out my new song, Nobody Else But You. Don't forget to dial in tonight talk with Joe Rocks. Thursday, 10 p.m. Eastern, exclusively on Arm Radio Global. Every Ladies and gentlemen, you, am I introducing you? Yeah, go yes, ahead. We're rolling. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, the man, the myth, the legend, wow. Joe Rock. Wow. Is, you know, Whoa. Now that's, 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 that's an introduction. I don't get I, I, I haven't had any. It's it. Joe. Oh, here we go. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> thank you. Welcome, everybody. Two X's, to, uh, baby. Two X's. <laughs> Night Talk. Um, it's our first show of the 2000, 2018. And uh, we have a we have a, a great great bunch of people on tonight with us. Um, uh, we have yeah we have we have um, Glenn Spillman, uh, yeah Sports Insider. Uh, every Wednesday and Friday, I, I, I give him. A, I think he comes on the show for, so I can give him a plug all the time. But I, I'm I'm, all, I'm constantly <laughs> plugging you, brother. Okay, I uh, appreciate that. Uh, also, the coach is here. Hello. Um, the coach. Uh, he he didn't you know I shoveled a path for him to get yeah, here. Did. Yeah, I did. But you didn't go down. Right in- no, I didn't do that. I'm not. I'm not doing that. Uh, Mary is also here. Hi, Mary. Hi, Mary. And Mary Milone, by the way, you Mary, never say my last name. Okay, because everybody, like everybody knows, knows who Mary is. They they do on this show. They do on on this show. Okay, <laughs> um, Mary Milone and uh, her social security number is no, I don't know. But yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Um, also, um, we have Casey here from Simply Casey. Uh, she's on Wednesday nights uh, at 10 Eastern. She's in her pajamas. Um, Hold on. I, I am in my pajamas. Yeah, she's in her pajamas. pajamas <laughs> um, and then my very, very special guest tonight is – now, I hope they say your name right. I know it's Josh. Uh, Josh I said it wrong when, I, when he was on my show. I said it wrong, so – uh, okay. It, 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 it's, it, it's Joshua T. Berglin. Is that correct? Yes. Yeah, that's really good. That's really good. <laughs> no, is it? Am I right? Am I right? Yeah. Uh, and he's from yes. uh, he's from Live Mana Worldwide. Is that right? No. 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 It's Lynn, Lynn Mona. Oh, I don't know. All right. Yeah, I got, I got no notes. From now on, let Mary say it. She no, I have no notes. I have no oh, notes. You know I what know I mean? you don't. You shoot from the hip. But yeah. you know no, it's okay. Yeah. Shoot from the hip. I got it, it, make, it makes for a great conversation well, piece. Yeah, uh, you know, I want to ask you, though, about that. I mean, I was always curious about that. Um, and, you know, uh, Mary has a special um, thing tonight on Thursday. I hope that she did it. Um, I don't know if she did, but oh, I was supposed to look up the meaning of one one one. No, <clears throat> no, uh, you know, like everything that happens on the date of Thursday. Like in other words, like uh, it was a today was like a special day. Like uh, I don't know, like uh, you know, like a special holiday or something was invented well, today. No, or well, that's a good, very good well, point. Well, I mean, so I, I, I and I and I asked her. I says, "Can you do four things for me?" And she goes, "Yeah, sure." And sure enough, she didn't. But anyway, um, you wanted me to look up one, the the meaning of one 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 because I know that. No, I don't know. No, 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 no I'm not super I don't know. I mean, Wait, Joe. For example, for example, yeah, uh, there's, a, there's a special blue moon coming out this month. Yeah. And no, no, just tonight, just today. I understand. Yeah. But we get nothing. We get one one one. Yeah. So uh, yeah. A blue moon. This That's month, special, you guys. That's spiritually special. What are you talking about? Ask Casey. Uh, yeah. No. It's. Is there a blue moon going on right now? I'm colorblind. I wouldn't know. So if, do, what, what happens with colorblind people? Do they get discriminated against during the time of the blue moon? Okay. I mean, like so, green. So, do yeah. I not get the same effect? That's kind of messed up if you ask me. Uh, I can't believe you. Yeah. So anyway, um, um, Joshua, um, 
can yes, you sir. know? I know you like to talk about yourself, so you know, you, you and I, we we're, we're we're similar in that way because we, you know, we're all about ourselves. Right. So same let's, old. Same huh? Old. So, same yeah, old. we're cut from the same cloth, right? And uh, Glenn's the same way too. He, he's, he loves he loves you know. Um, but anyway, uh, t- tell me a little bit about yourself, uh, Joshua. Us, the uh, don't hold so back. Don't hold actually, back. And he's he's a, a really good looking guy. Girls out there, no, you know, huh? He's yeah. not really. Josh is very pretty. Yeah. Good looking guy. Huh, Glenn? He's very beautiful, man. <laughs> you got a pretty mouth. <laughs> you got a pretty mouth, boy. Go ahead, Go ahead Joshua. <laughs> all right. Listen. And so, first of all, Joe Rocks with two X's is completely wrong. I hate talking about myself. I do a show in the morning called Morning Gratitude with the Mayor, and I interview people because I don't want to talk about myself. So, I don't mind sharing my story. So with that said, I really am grateful to be on the show tonight because, uh, you know, first of all, I've been, I dig what you do, man. Uh, Mary, I'm a huge fan of, so thank you so much for having me on your show tonight. Yep. And uh, you know what? I really don't even want to talk about what I, what I, what I do. I uh, yes, my company is live model worldwide. It's a verb for live powerfully globally. My company, the purpose of my company and what we do is to make really to take other people's lives, their brand, and just make it reach its full potential, man. I just love helping people. I love empowering people to do great things. And that's what it's all about. But I sure, I don't want to talk about that tonight. You know what I want to talk about? Because I'm your guest. And if I get to talk, if I had the airspace, let's talk about the internet of everything. All right. You know what? What do you guys think about the internet of everything? 5G technology. You guys know anything about it? Uh, that's over my head. We were, lucky. we were lucky to get logged on tonight. No, obviously. <laughs> you wonder why we love her, huh? You wonder why we love her. Wait, listen, oh. She tells it like it is. Okay. You know what? Since we can't talk about that, let's talk about Oprah running for president. What do you guys think? Uh, well, we need Kimberly for that. No, uh, well. No, I, we need Kimberly for that. You know, yeah, let's go Kimberly back. Well, I mean, you know, you know, in all fairness, I mean, I think that, um, you know, Glenn Spillman's all, all hip to that stuff because he's from California. Right, Glenn? I'm hip right. to a lot of things, yeah. Open for president, though. You know, you got another one out there. The Rock put his Yeah, I saw that. Yeah. The Rock's out there, too. So, he is? The rock, yeah, The Rock. Yep. The, rock so, the uh, Rock might throw his hat into the ring. Yeah, I mean, that's all you have to be now is just famous and you can run for president. That's right. I, I, you know, I, I keep on looking this way. That's all you have to be is famous and you can run for president now, you know, basically. So... You know, maybe I'll throw my hat in the ring uh, 2020 you if I, you know, if I get up there at one point. You have to be famous first. <laughs> yeah, that's. Oh! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I, I, I was mean spirited. I apologize. No, 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 no. I'll put my numbers up against you. I'll that's end time. Wait, Emily. <laughs> you wait. <laughs> We don't, we don't apologize. <laughs> well played, sir. Well played. You win. Oh, no. Um, no. I'll, I'll, I, yeah, so let's talk about Oprah for a second. Oh, did you do the thing, Mary, or not? Actually, I'm Googling it now, and it's bringing me to a Muslim page, but in honor of Kimberly, I don't want to I don't want to talk about it. Right, good okay, okay. Good yeah, yeah, yeah. Good, uh, uh, good, good choice. Uh, Kimberly Nix Murray is not here tonight. Um, she's next. Uh, yeah, she's yeah. <laughs> she's next. So okay, so um, let's continue with the conversation about uh, Oprah. How are you feeling about that, um, Josh? Oh, the, here's here's the thing. I, I, in my personal belief system in the way the government works is I, I don't look real fondly at our government. The government. Um, I do think it's really. I think it's funny that all the, there's a huge population of people that complained about Trump not having any experience and he was not fit for president he had no experience no training no political background nothing and now i'm curious i actually put a poll out on facebook just about 30 minutes ago while i was waiting for your technology to work um (laughs) we're gonna go at each other tonight back and forth back and forth a lot happens from my after my show, Morning Gratitude, I get a little grumpy after a while. So. Well, you, you, anyway. you're, you're the big deal, right? you got producers and stuff like that. Is that right? Or are you do it as a one-man band? Are you do it yourself? You know what? To be honest with you, I started that show 
really just to try to bring joy to people's lives because it, people's lives. what are you smoking? You know, yeah. Come on, what are you smoking? Come on, cut the bullshit, will you? Joy to <laughs> yeah. you, you can tell he's from California or someplace like that. Where are you I'm from? I'm from Oklahoma, man. Come on. Uh, all right, I'm just I, no, no, straight up. There was so much negative news all the time. It was so, like, when I first started it, it was literally me picking up my phone, and I was like, you know what? I'm going to talk each day on Facebook Live about what I'm grateful for. And this is, I'm being very, very honest, right? I'm being very authentic. And it was fun. It was like always at different times. And I went and heard TD Jakes talk. And he was using an analogy of an airplane trying to land with one wing. And your mindset was you could focus on the fact that you only have one wing, go, oh crap, I have one wing and crash. Or you could go, I have one wing and I'm going to land this son of a bitch. Yep. And. So what you, the backstory is, I was supposed to do a show for Fox Business. Oh, nice. The production company dropped the ball, and my dreams of being a TV host completely just fell on its face. And I was I was heartbroken because I was pumped up. These guys like were just selling me hardcore about how I was going to be the next great thing on TV. And I was really discouraged after it fell apart. Because I, I put it out on Facebook that I was going to be hosting a show, and I... You are. You're on armed radio. <laughs> well, Don't be a wise ass, Mary. Go ahead. Yeah. A network show. I put on Fox. I mean, I even tagged Fox Business. I did all of these douchey 